Pronto. Oh, barrito. Ah, barrito. You really want that popcorn? Yeah, oh. I do. I do popcorn. I do. All right, we're gonna get the popcorn. Oh. I will show you guys the entire crime scene and leave no detail displayed. I am wholeheartedly confused. Like, I'm not half-heartedly confused. It's like a whole heart of confusion right now. Uh, Hi! What are Thanks for clicking and welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are going to be doing a grocery shopping on a hundred dollar budget and we're going to be using Misfits Market as well. If you'd like a code for Misfits Market, I'm going to have one in the description below and I'll probably comment on the comment section um, something just to like highlight it and showcase it if you're interested in using Misfits Market. So I know that in the past we've done twenty dollar grocery shopping, fifty dollar grocery shopping, and now we're doing a hundred dollar grocery shopping which sounds like a huge jump and it kind of is but we have five of us eating in the house right now so twenty dollars per person per week doesn't sound too bad for me and especially since we're going to be incorporating organic food into our diet I think it's pretty good. I signed up for Misfits Market about a week ago and they sent me an email saying that I can now build my box. I have never done this before and I've seen a couple Misfits Market reviews but I've never seen like the actual Misfits interface where you can actually choose your stuff, what you want, and all that stuff. So let's get to that today, and then whatever we choose on the Misfits Market is going to help us like build our menu. So today we're going to go shopping, build our menu, and then on Sunday when our box is actually going to be delivered, we're also going to go grocery shopping for our actual stuff that we're going to use with our fruits and vegetables. But I did the Madness box. It is $35, and I think it's great because it'll give us a good portion of fruits and vegetables. So let's see what we're going to look into. I'm just going to really quickly pull up the Misfits Market page, and I'm putting myself all the way to the left because I want to put the Misfits Market, like, over there, you know, you know. Say hi. Can you say hi? Say hello, Lolo. Mom, I say bye. Say bye, please. It's not time to say bye yet. Bye. Okay, so we got Misfits Market up on the screen and we're going to start customizing our box now. So this is our last day that we have to build the box and so I am a procrastinator in every aspect of my life at this point. We're going to build our box. I feel like this is what we click, so we're going to click it. Ooh, stuff is looking good. Oh my goodness. Okay, we have some oranges still. I'm kind of sick of oranges at this point, so I'm not going to get oranges. I'm just... I'm not gonna get oranges. I still have some potatoes right now. Wow, they have a lot of stuff. They have a decent amount of stuff. All right, so group one, you're supposed to select six. Group two, you select six. What? And group three, you select two. All right, so I think uh, because I took so long to do my box this time, there are some items that are sold out. Whoops, whoops. Okay, I, I picked those, but. So there's organic beets, cilantro, grapefruit, lemons, navel oranges, organic mm. jalapenos. Um, I don't know how I like the, the customized picks yet, so, you know, closing that. Um, so then there's also or or carrots, beef steak tomatoes, and broccoli. Oh, that would have been nice. Celery root, iceberg lettuce, parsnips, watermelon. <gasps> watermelon! No! Okay, uh... Spinach, baby turnips. Boys, you want to help us pick the grocery list for this week? You want to see what we want? Oh, there's broccoli. There's broccoli right there. Okay, so what kind of broccoli is this? Oh, organic broccoli crown. Okay, and this is organic bunched broccoli. All right, guys, what do we want this week? What do we want to get? We can do some acorn squash. Do you want some of this? No, no, no. No, bad. It's not bad. It tastes good. Auntie Bimoli made it, remember? Apple. You, you want the apple? Okay, I think we... Did we select some apples down... Okay, do you want this apple or do you want this apple? I want this. This one? The Fuji one? Yeah. Okay. We can do zucchini, right? You like this? We can make a zucchini. Um, You want zucchini? Okay, yeah. so let's do yeah, zucchini. Okay, what else do we want to do? Um, this. This one? The yeah. parsley? Yeah. Ooh, I don't know what I put parsley in, but we can do that one. Okay. Um, Let's see what else. Hmm, we have to pick a few more. We have to pick three more. We don't like green bell peppers because they hurt my stomach and grandma's stomach, so... Oh, let's do some onions, okay? And then... I want to do the acorn squash, so I'm going to do the acorn squash, okay? And then Mom, what do you I want? I have to eat that. That's okay. If you don't want to eat it, but you can give it a try, maybe, okay? Okay. 
Um, so do you want the tomatoes or the potatoes or the russet potatoes? Or the, you want the potatoes? Yeah. Okay, so then we got to eat all the potatoes that we have right now before Sunday, okay? Yeah. You like these, right? Yeah, I like these. Yummy, yummy. There you go. Okay. We should probably get some lettuce too, right? Oh, Arky. Don't do that, buddy. He is mm. trying to scroll. This body. You, oh, broccoli. Okay, hold on, Arky, please. Arky. Over there, over there. There's the broccoli. There's the broccoli. Oops. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Do you want to do cabbage? Or kale? Or hold on. Yeah, cabbage. Yeah. Cabbage? This one down here. Yeah. This one. Down here. Yeah. Okay. Now come on, sit. Sit down. Yep, you can come and sit. Come and sit. Hmm? Come up. Okay. Alright. Okay, what else do we want? What do you want? The orange? The. Mm, I don't actually cook with those very well, buddy. You want to need. Ooh. Oh, dude. What do you do with that one you pick, huh? What do you do with that one? The lettuce? Yeah. Okay, I was thinking we needed some lettuce. What else do we want, buddy? We got broccoli and we got... We got cabbage. this. Oh, we can't get those carrots. They're out. They're sold out. We don't have any more. Sorry. Do we like... grape tomatoes? No, no, no. Yeah, no need. Do we want to make some lemon? Yeah, do this. Okay. Do this. Okay. Yeah. And then tomatoes... Wait, let's see. There are tomatoes up here, but we would have to trade them for something. And since there are apples down there, can we do these apples down here? And then we can unclick these apples up here. They're a little different, but it's okay. And then we can get the tomatoes. You see? So we got tomatoes. And now down here, because I don't like grape tomatoes very much. Not very much. The skin is too thick, you know? Do you want to try these pears too? Yeah, 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 yeah. You want to try these pears? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Okay. All right. So I guess that's what we chose. These are add-ons. Clementines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Next week we'll get some more oranges, okay? We have two avocados right now, okay? Yeah. Yeah, I like this. Do you want it sweet or do you want it salty? No, salty. Okay, yeah. so sweet. She, she's salty, yeah. Yep, yeah, salty, yep. In the box, where that box. Hi, you saw chocolate? Yeah. No, we're not gonna get that chocolate. Huh. Mm, milk? That's milk, Mom. Go back. Go back, please. Milk? Yeah. That's the come. Yeah. That's the come, Mark. No, 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 no. I'm just looking through all this stuff. Okay, Mommy said. You guys are crushing me, huh? stomping on my leg. Arker. No, 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 no. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh my, oh my. Oh my is right. Oh my right. Oh my. Hip. Oh my hip. 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 My hip. My hip. Oh my hip. Ah, my hip. Oh my, my hip. Ah, my, my hip. My hip, my hip, hip, hip. My hip, my hip, 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 yeah, oh. I do. I do pop up. I do. Alright, we're gonna get the popcorn. Oh. Okay, so. Kasha. Excuse me. I do be. Mom, let's fly down on me. Let's fly down. I'm not trying to drop you. I'm not gonna drop you. Don't worry. I got you. Alright, so our subtotal is like, it's $36.99, I think. So basically, we're getting some Roma tomatoes, some zucchini, acorn squash, yellow potatoes, organic flat leaf parsley, yellow onions, bosch pears, uh, mango, romaine lettuce, green cabbage, bunched broccoli, pink lady apples, and organic pears and limes. So, and then we added on that that uh, popcorn mm. down there. So we are a handful today. This is this is nice. Okay, hold on. Mm -hmm. Hey, young man, just after I said this is nice, you go somewhere we cannot Where return from. People? Oh, we have returned. Okay, okay, okay. Where? Wait, have we returned? You're freezing up the computer, young man. So that is what our Misfits Market box is looking like right now. And then we will go over and make a menu plan and I'll catch up with you guys soon. But I'm going to get this guy calmed down a little bit. He seems like he wants to play. So we're going to go play for a little bit.
and he he just trashed the computer. Okay, see you in a bit. <laughs> okay, so we did some playing, and I strapped a little guy to my back because he did not want to be put down. So we're going to finish up our list. We're going to decide what we're going to get for groceries and plan our menu. This is all the stuff that we got on Misfits Market, so I'm going to include all of that into our, you know, thingy. This is my list from last week, and I'm going to put anything that I didn't use I'm going to put towards this one so we can see if we can cut costs. I know I do need to also get diapers this week, so I think I'm going to use the acorn squash as a side, so I'm probably going to steam it, you know, with some salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. I'm thinking I'm going to make a zucchini lasagna. I would do the zucchini in place of the pasta. I already have marinara sauce, so I'm going to use what I have. And then I have tofu as well, so that is good. I'm also going to need some cashew cheese, so I already did a bell pepper that I have roasted in the freezer, so I'll thaw that and use that for a cashew cheese, so I think we're all good. Are you getting caught? What's wrong? What's wrong? Are you okay, Arky? You want to get out? You want me to stand up? Yeah, see, sometimes children just want you to stand up and it's tragic because you be standing up all day and they still don't appreciate it. They just don't. Isn't that right, young man? Okay, so for juice, we're gonna make a limeade and then all the fruits are just gonna be for snacks. We're just gonna eat all the fruits. So the pears, the mango, the apples, the other pear. Um, that's all just gonna be like fruit snacks, like snacks. Okay, so I need to make some general sao tofu. I can add some broccoli to it. Broccoli. And then I'm going to do cabbage. <laughs> then when we're done with the cabbage, we can make cabbage sandwiches with plantains because I have one plantain left. So that means we're going to need bread from the store. Wait, I do have one bread in the freezer. <sighs> Okay, do I need to buy anything this week? Okay, I want to make a cottage cheese loaf. So I'm gonna buy cottage cheese at the store and we can make mashed potatoes with that. Oh, oh, careful, careful, careful. And then we still have Roma tomatoes and lettuce. So that means we're gonna make sandwiches. So we are gonna need another loaf of bread and we're going to use the tofurkey that I have in the fridge with lettuce, tomatoes, mayonnaise, pickles probably. Are you okay, buddy? So we'll just make tofurkey sandwiches. Spinach dip. Mark, you really want to come down or you just want me to bob you? You do want to get out, don't you? What, what do you need, sir? Do you need to get out? Blink one for yes, two for no. Oh, he blinked once. All right, are you sure? Our first Misfits Marketplace box just arrived and we're about to open it up. Super exciting. Okay, so we've opened up the box. This is what it looks like inside. There's some insulating, I think, paper on top. And then there's a huge ice pack right there. So we've got some lettuce. That's a huge thing of lettuce. Two huge things of lettuce. We're gonna have salad for days. Next we have the parsley, which I told you guys I had no idea what to do with, but I'm gonna make it work. Now I have way more parsley than I anticipated, so we definitely have to figure out how to cook this. We got that popcorn. This is not included in the $35. This was an add-on, so I'm going to just put this away. So this is the zucchini, and we've got another zucchini, some more zucchini, oh my goodness. One is broken, but that's okay. It's gotta be broken to get cooked anyway. We've got another zucchini down here and that other piece of zucchini. Yeah, we've got a lot of zucchini. There's your other halves in your sands. We've got a little bit of lettuce that we're gonna put back with our lettuce bunch. This is another zucchini, wow. And here we have our Roma tomatoes. So we got sent eight Roma tomatoes, which is pretty awesome. Broccoli's right here. Some of them are falling apart, so that's okay. We make them like this anyway before we cook them. So broccoli stems, I'm not very well versed with. I think I'm gonna ask my mom. She might have a way to cook them. 
Up next, we've got two acorn squashes, a little cabbage. It's a teeny weeny cabbage. I thought that it would be bigger, but it's so cute and tiny. So we've got one onion down here, another onion. So two onions and that's good because I'm always getting bags of onions and I don't use that many onions. And then sometimes some of the onions go bad, so. Two onions is great, especially because these are like bigger sized onions. And then we got some potatoes. We got four of these. I guess you could make a side of mashed potatoes with these. So then we've got limes, and these limes are actually a lot bigger than I thought they were going to be. There's two more over there, so that's a really good amount of limes to make maybe limeade. And then we've got some apples in here, some pears, some more Bosch pears over there, and some mangoes. Okay, so the box is empty, and that's what it looks like inside. And this is what the table looks like. So I think I want to adjust our menu a little bit to incorporate all of this stuff. This was, again, the Madness box. It was $35. $5, and then there was shipping on top of it, but I also got a $10 off coupon and you can get a $10 off coupon as well if you use my code in the description. We're gonna adjust the menu a little bit and I'll get back to you guys. Okay, so it's the last day of the sales ad, so we're procrastinating yet again. Today we're gonna hope to run to the grocery store and get a couple things. I was supposed to go on Sunday, but Sunday was a really ugly, ugly day and I did not want to go out of the house, so some steamed vegetables maybe. Definitely want these for breakfast. These, I kind of just want to try. Every time I try organic ranch, it does not taste the same. So I'm hoping that this organic ranch tastes good. It's peppercorn Happy ranch, Happy. so maybe it will. I want to get one of these because I want to start incorporating more rice, brown rice into our diet. And it's organic, which is great. We have tortilla chips still from last week's shopping trip. And we have tons of hummus that we need to finish, so that's great. I was also thinking some maybe tart cherry juice because it's good for blood pressure regulation and stuff. Not that I need that, but you know, if you think about that early on, then you won't have to think about it later. One of my friends was telling me about kombucha, and so I, I told him I would give it a try the next time I went to the grocery store. Of course, if it's not in the budget, it's just not in the budget, but um... We will give that a second look. Okay guys, so it's Tuesday and I'm on my way to the grocery store. We haven't told you about this car yet, but I will tell you about it soon. I just hopped in the car for the first time since maybe a week or so. And there was a whole puddle of water underneath, like on top of my mat and underneath the mat. Like I took the mat up and there was just like a whole puddle of water under there and I found that out because I put my foot on the ground and then it slipped off of the gas pedal and I was like whoa I literally have no towels in here or anything I just have emergency diapers in the back so dang those emergency diapers are gone honestly I have no theories I'm a little confused slash a lot confused like I am I'm wholeheartedly confused like I'm not half-heartedly confused it's like a whole heart of confusion right now anyways we're going grocery shopping I finalized the menu I'm kind of excited about it so there's that and I'm going to just Aldi and Lidl right now. I think we had like $44 and 60 something cents that we could spend after my mom got me yogurt and soy milk at Costco and BJ's. We get shelf life soy milk because it lasts longer and I think it's a better deal. Regular soy milk, not that I ever listened to this, but regular soy milk or an almond milk say on the box like after you open it please consume within seven days. And um, sis, that's, that's just impossible for somebody who doesn't drink that much milk. Wow, my hair is looking really crazy, but you know what? It's cute, so I got over it two seconds ago. I'm still at like complete mystery about how this water appeared. So I will show you guys the entire crime scene and leave no detail undisplayed. I'm also on the last day of the sale for Aldi and Lidl, so this is like complete trash, but the good thing is if I forget anything, I'll be shopping on Sunday, so that's great. I'm convinced. I left the door open. I have to have left the door open. I was supposed to go that way. I ended up going this way. Okay, so I'll go to Lidl first and then come back and circle down this way. Oh, I'm sorry. I just thought about what if I left my grocery list at home, but I just remember... Oh, okay. I see it. It's there. It's okay. It's been a day, you guys. It's been a day! Okay, so we have hit another dilemma. That is the fact that I just realized that I don't have my mask because I took all my masks and was like, I'm gonna do laundry today. And the laundry, you know, is still in the laundry machine right now. And, uh, hmm, well, my best bet is this, right? So drive-thrus, right? 
the people at the drive-thru, they have a mask on. So right now I'm at CVS and they should sell masks inside. So imagine if the person that's at the drive-thru pharmacy area could just do me a solid and sell me a mask through the window. Wouldn't that be great? That would be pretty great. They might just look at me like I'm crazy and be like, get out of my drive-thru, but you know, it's worth a shot and I won't have to drive 60 miles back home. How can I help you? Hi, um, this is a really weird question, but do you guys sell masks? Uh, yeah. Do you want like a box or do you just need like one? Just one. I forgot my mask and I was hoping you could like sell one to me like through okay. the drive thru. If you don't mind, I can just give you one. Oh. Okay, so Thank you so much. I didn't touch that. Thank you so much. Thank you. You too. Oh my gosh. Okay, that just made my day. Now I don't have to drive all the way home when I'm already out here. So exciting because that was a little bit overwhelming. Like, okay, today has been a little rough. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's still been a good day, but it's been a rough day. Like, the boys have been challenging me today. Like, they just, they just have, and you know, <sighs> I just felt like I would never get out of the house today. And if I went back, then I would never get out again to go do this grocery shopping that I'm already years late at doing. So I was I was really worried about that. And the fact that now I just got a mask, like she was so nice. She was so nice, you guys. I was fully prepared to actually pay for a mask, but she just gave me like a regular one, um, like one of theirs, I guess, that are back there for the employees to use, like one of these. That just, you know, there are just these things that happen during the day sometimes and they just take a lot of stress off you and that was one of the things. So, I am fully appreciative. <laughs> okay, I have to drop some things off at Goodwill because uh, my trunk is completely full of stuff. So, I will be right back. Okay, to Lidl now. It's my brand new fancy schmancy mask. Peru. Is that Lidl I see in the distance? Are they closed? <laughs> they closed. Oh, sorry. Are they closed? The guy said it says closed. Oh, okay, wow. I'm gonna go with it. Probably had a COVID case or something. Oh, my goodness. I don't know. There's some reason they're closed in the middle of the day. That is so <laughs> strange. <laughs> oh, no. Thank you. Needle is closed. So we have to get. Oh gosh, how does that short us? How much does that short us? I feel like we're gonna go over today now because we're gonna have to either get everything at Aldi or go to, well, junk. I'm not sure exactly. Or go to Walmart? I, mean, I gotta look at our list. But um, yeah, we're gonna have to improvise a little bit and get everything at Aldi. Let's do it. Whenever somebody passes me like a maniac, I always have to think that I'm going too slow. But I'm going 45, Chunk. I am going 40. That's a high car. It's a really high car. Um, anyways, yeah. I'm going 45 miles per hour. I mean, like, literally. People cut in front of you just to go to the same destination. Just to come and stop at the same light right here in front of this Chick-fil-A. I mean, bro, did you get... I mean, were you happy with those two inches of clearance to come and stop at the same light? Of course you're sporting baby Yoda, I'm attacking. Sorry, I'm about to wind up my window. I felt really bad because I was like asking the lady questions through my mask and I was like, oh dang, I forgot I'm wearing a mask. And then she came over to the car window, she was wearing a mask and I felt bad, like I was like, oh, let me wind down my window. My windows are not automatic. So I'm like reaching over of my tiny arms to like undo the thing. Um, so I could talk to her, but uh, she was very nice. She was very nice. If we have to go to Walmart, we're going over for sure. You pick up like 10 items in Walmart and you're like broke. Especially where produce is concerned. Their mangoes are always like a dollar and 20 cents, even if they're rotting. It's like, bro, you didn't want to bring the price down so bad that you let all of this produce go to waste. Like, come on, I mean at least make 60 cents a pop. When I get out at Aldi, I'll show you guys the diapers beneath my feet. The ones that are saving me from slipping off the gas pedal. See these diapers down here? Yeah, it looks pretty crazy. So are my boots. It looks like I'm very off-roading. So do my tires. This diaper, completely soaked, completely. Which I know you don't want to see in a, a grocery shopping video. This is not pee, I promise, it's water. Whenever I was moving and I needed to clean out the bottom of the deep freezer and I didn't want to take it all the way out of the house to dump it 
I would always use diapers and throw them in the bottom. I always save the ones that the boys grow out because you never know when you're gonna need diapers for anything, to unclog a drain even. Can't reach almost. There we go. Third time's the charm. Do, 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 do. Okay, so I'm looking for chickpeas or garbanzo beans, but I don't see them. I mean, do they not sell garbanzo beans here? I mean, I've never bought them here, so I don't know, or have I? I can't remember. But I'm sad. Okay, so we just got out of Aldi, and I did have my mask on, I just took it off just now. Um, But we got sliced cheese, another sliced cheese, um, whole wheat bread, organic bananas, like two bunches, large eggs, two of those, some diapers, avocados, Parmesan cheese, Indian sauces. We got the tiki masala sauce that I wanted. And then we got laundry detergent, one plantain because I already ate the other plantain that I wanted to eat and a cottage cheese. So there were a lot of things that I didn't make last week that I can put towards this week. So that's why it was kind of light shopping this week and we only spent $23.95. So that means we have a good chunk of money to put towards next month's budget. I mean. Okay, so for our first thing, we're gonna take the split up zucchini, chop off the split off part, you know, and we're going to grate it to make some zucchini pancakes. Since that was a lot more zucchini than I anticipated, I think we're gonna make uh, some zucchini pancakes and some zucchini bread. Man, I missed the crack, I'm so sorry. You're fine. Two. You got one. You got to do one. That's all. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna end the video here, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. And thank you so much for watching. Bye. Please don't forget to like and subscribe as well and tap that notification bell. Thanks for watching and see you soon. More videos come, so please stay tuned.